So, uh, I'll give it another go. I'm gonna, oh, I didn't save after I got, I definitely like this, this grouping of three for this. So, let's uh, switch. Alright, and I'm gonna check out gear. Robo definitely needs a better something. Um, okay, so what's his armor? 75 and 36? That's actually not bad. Oh, these two are a lot better. 76 is good. Um, luminous robes he can't wear. If he can wear the raven armor, it's slightly better. No, he can't. Had a feeling. Had a feeling. All right. Um, this I can definitely switch out. Frogs. Power glove. I don't really need to do. This could be good. A little more defense. Magic we don't need. Reduces MP. That could be real good. Don't need that because it probably won't work. Automatically rev. Oh. I should save that. Can't control where I don't want that. Don't need that. Crit ray we don't really need. Muscle ring. Oh, that's actually that's better. Let's do that. Um Is there something on Robo that can Yeah, this. I might go with this. Boost his defense a little bit. His speed goes down, but. Alright, alright. Maybe this will make a difference, maybe it won't. Who knows? I also gotta, okay, I gotta look at my techs. Does anyone have a really good heal everyone? Heal beam, small amount to all allies. Probably not the best. Cure, what is this? Arise. Yo! I need that, <laughs> I need that. Um, heal does everyone. A moderate, heal could be good. Oh, and this. Double cure. Fully restores all allies HP and status. That's what I need to be doing. That's what I need to be doing. Because that'll save me a turn healing everyone. Okay. I feel like in general, I got to be better about using double techs. Because I don't do it that often. And I should. Okay, so that's whenever he uses a, a max... Not... Not Max Flare, that's Pokemon. Just Flare. That's what I gotta do. And then Robo will still have his turn to attack. Alright, let's try this again. We've updated our equipment a little bit. Alright, so... Oh no, you attack. You're rouletting, spinning right off the bat. Don't know what to do with that is. Not right, and then... We haste. Ho ho! All right, all right. Flare, okay. So this is where we bust it out. This is where we bust out the double. Combo. Double cure. Well, it would work if Robo were alive. Then it would work great. Does it bring him back? That would be broken. That would be so broken if it brought him back. All right. We need water. All right, <laughs> not off to a great start. But, could be worse. All right, I'm gonna haste Frog next, so we can get those double cures when we need them. Not double, even it's everyone cure, triple cure, which we need right now. Right now we need. Where is it? Oh my God! He keeps like double team and Robo. All right, all right, all right, all right. 
Combo. Double cure, even though it's everyone. Well, I guess it's two people doing the cure. So. There we go. Back to full. Robo can go. Stop doing the flare. Stop it. Alright, that wasn't it. I gotta wait. Combo. Double cure. Whew. Alright. Robo's not dead. I gotta... He has to not flare for one second. So I can haste Robo. Haste. Robo. I wish there was a way to sort... Sort text. But it's fine. It's I get it. I don't think he can actually do stuff while I'm in the menus. Maybe he can. I don't know. Okay. Okay. Is that it? No. Is that it? Yes! Okay. Okay. We are in the money now. Unless he flares. Which he just did. Which he just did. Double cure, and then we're right back in it. All right. There, now we are cooking. Until he spins again. Let's get cure two on frog just to be safe. Because I think a flare might kill him. Oh! Okay, the crit doesn't carry over to the Son of the Sun. All right, now we're in the group. Now I'm feeling good. If I can get three in before he spins, that would be amazing. Oh my god, yes. Alright, now he's spinning. That's fine, that's fine. He didn't flare though. Okay, yes he did. <laughs> yes he did. Double cure. Let's try this guy. Alright, now with this strat, I feel like it's just, just a matter of time. Or a matter of... Oh my god, yes. Okay, okay. Anytime he does the laser beam move, I just got a regular heal with someone. Anytime he does flare, we do the double thing. And uh, at some, eventually we are going to have to try and heal some MP. But I can do that with Robo's turn. Son of the Sun is losing his light! Ho ho ho! Alright! I kind of want to leave and save, but I feel like I'm worried that'll respawn him. And I feel like this is just it. Please don't fight me again. Yes! This is the Sunstone of Antiquity. It appears to have lost the light it once possessed. However, it may be possible to recharge it by exposing it to sunlight for a long enough period of time. By my best estimate, it would require a minimum of 65 million years of constant exposure. We got the Moonstone. All right. So before ending off, this might be a bit of a longer episode as well, but I know exactly what we have to do, and I want to finish off this, this little quest. That felt good. That I love that fight. I don't know if I would have figured it out on my own, which is why we got people like Joshua up in here. You know, it's all about uh, solving the puzzle, figuring out the missing piece, in this case, double cure so I didn't have to just spend all my time curing and now we're good to go all right so the uh, the Sun Shrine is this it's here in every age I'm pretty sure 
So we gotta go here. Sunlight reaches this location 24 hours per day. Place the moonstone here? Yes, I will. We should now return to my era in the epoch. Does it have to be Robo's era? Because this is 65 million BC, a minimum of 65 million years. Anything like Middle Ages should work. But Robo has requested that we go to his era. And Robo is the man, so. We're not a man, it's a robot. Robo is the Robo. So we will listen to him. All right, and I guess, you know, having it soak in sunlight Oh no! The Moonstone is no longer here! But the evidence indicates it was not taken recently. We should look for it in an earlier- Oh, someone swiped it. Alright, alright. So, this should technically still be long enough. Alright, let's go here. Sun Shrine. Ah! Holy, what's this? Strength capsule! Let me pick it up. What? I can't... Excuse me? Can I not pick it up yet? Is it not... It said a minimum of 65 million years. Alright, I guess I'll... Go to the present. I'll try this. A little bit longer. Get a little more time to soak. And now it's gone. It does not appear to be here either. Perhaps someone from this era has taken it. Alright, who in this era is a thief? Is it, um... No, it's not... Toma, because he's in the Middle Ages. That's his grave. All right. Well, this might end up being another two-parter. Who knows? But we are. F I'm. I'm gonna keep going until I find this freaking thing. Tale of Sir Cyrus and his loyal friend Glenn is an old one. It's been 400 years since Sir Cyrus fought Magus. Look at that. Look at that. Changing. Changing the dialogue because we restored the grave of Cyrus. Love that. Um. Did any of you steal a stone? Does someone at the fair have it? Someone. Someone like, yo, I found this. Well, it's probably someone near the shrine, which the fair is. Um, uh, or this isn't the fair. No, this is this is not the fair. Is one island over? We already come here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We did. Uh, this is where like you could pick between a really good weapon or a really good armor. All right. Who is this guy? Ozzy the 13th? Yes, sir! I'm scrubbing as hard as I can. I'm not a slacking off, I swear. <laughs> Why's he gotta be so mean? Yo, what is going on here? This work is brutal. The name's Bendu. Uh, here to try, or here to build the ferry that'll service, what? Here to build the ferry that's to service Medea and Truce. Okay. I'm the mayor of Medea. Make yourself at home. Did you steal a sunstone, sir? Anyone here? I'm looking for a sunstone, sir. This work is brutal. Okay. Seems like you're just walking back and forth, but uh, that's fine. So this is like the monster village. Oh right, there's a gate in there. I don't want to actually go. No, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> I'm going back. This might end up... I might have to split this in two as well. Or just say, screw it. We're, we're, uh, we're rolling with it. Depends. It depends. But I am going to find this freaking thing and finish this quest. Also, I don't know if I mentioned. Well, maybe it's not anymore. But this is episode 50 of Chrono Trigger. How about that? How about that? 50 episodes. Mark it. Did you get it and are you selling it? That'd be that would be crazy. But I would love that. No, okay, okay. 
Uh, I wonder if Melchior just has it. He's just like, yo, I found this. Because that's who you're supposed to bring it to. Um, okay. Seems like... There's probably someone I talked to who was like... Uh, man, I could really go for a sun... Oh, I talked to him again. Okay, we'll stay the night, I guess. I guess we'll stay the night. Okay, so it doesn't appear to be here anywhere. I bet it's somewhere at the festival. I bet there was someone there who was like, Yo, okay, that we're not dealing with yet. Not until we get Chrono back. Do you... Yeah, 1000th anniversary, wow. I got out of the castle again. Indeed she did. Um... Do you? I don't, I don't care about the race. There's that thing. Huh. Alright, big war. Yeah, yeah. I might end up just cutting this out. Or I'll leave it in. I don't know. The merchant who were in the square have all left to restock. Why not pay the town market a visit? I suppose I could. Oh, I don't care about silver points. No, 50 bucks? That's nothing. Uh, your wife made that lunch? Okay, okay. Huh. Huh. Okay. Our cat ran away. I still don't know where our cat is. Um, not this. I might end up... I might just straight up Google this, to be honest. Just for the sake of not having a super long episode. It's going to be super long anyway. Um, Who stole the Moonstone Chrono Trigger? By an explorer who delivers it to the poor mayor. Okay. Poor we want to go to. Which I think is not this one. Uh, I'm pretty sure poor is down. I still don't know what the deal with this whirlpool is. I should probably do that. See what that's about. I think this is... Oh! I would say this is probably it. Alright. Alright. You're interested in the Moonstone! A passing young traveler left it here. By all means, take it! Seems to be important to you folks. Yo! Okay, I think this is the mayor who was like super greedy. And then I like... In the past, I like... Bought something off of... Or, or I sold something to someone. His wife, and then I... Or someone... I don't know. There was a, an event here. Where, in the Middle Ages, someone bought my jerky for a bunch of money. And so I did it, but then I, like, had to reset. And off screen, I was like, you know what, just take it. And he went, this guy went from being super greedy to super generous. I'm wondering if I had stuck with the, uh, the greedy guy, if I had actually sold the money, I would have to buy the stone off him. I bet, I bet that's the case. Okay, so now we have to give this stone to Melchior. Ooh, I don't remember where he is. So I might have to Google that again. We're going to get Google back. Uh, because I want to finish this up. Okay. We just got the wiki page for the Sunstone. Um, Sunstone, so, Mayor Poor, it regains its former luster and is used partly to create the Sunshades by Tabin, the one, okay, so we can get a, a couple of stuff, the Rainbow by Melchior, where is he, where is Melchior, doesn't say on this page. Okay, let's look at the Melchior page. Whoa, his... 
picture looks weird and also... Uh, um... There's nothing in his wiki entry. Okay! Storyline? There's nothing here. Oh, okay. It's like different pages. That's weird. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Um... You have the sunstone, he'll make some stuff. Oh, he's still in the castle with the, the rainbow shell. Okay, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. And he should still be in the castle if I am interpreting this correctly. So let's see, Guardy Castle. Uh, he's in the, the basement. This might end up being two episodes again. Who knows? Oh, this isn't right. Uh, yeah, this is it, I'm pretty... I think he's still down here, so if we have both of them, he's gonna give us something real cool. We do have both the rainbow shell and the sunstone. Ah, an interesting substance. I could make some in, something impressive if only I had another material to combine it with. Like the sunstone? How do I do this? Uh, the moon, oh, it didn't finish, it's still the moonstone because someone stole it, do I have to go put it back, or do I have to figure out who stole it, and then stop them from stealing it, huh, huh, Okay, okay. Well, at this rate, this is definitely going to be two episodes. Because I'm going to keep going. Alright. Okay, let's... No, I don't want to be in the future. I want to be in the past. Prehistoric. Or do I put it back? Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. If I just do this, it's just gonna get stolen again. Idea. Idea. We put it back in the present. Because theoretically it's already absorbed a certain amount of sunlight. So if I put it back now, whoever stole it won't know to steal it again. And then I can come back in the future when it's nice and done, and we'll be ready to go. Place the Moonstone. Okay. Okay. I understand. I understand. I think. Or I'm overthinking it, and you are supposed to just put it back. Okay. Alright. There we go. My sensors detect high energy levels. Luca will likely be able to use this. We should show it to her. Oh, do I have to have Luca in the party? Alright. Luca. There you go. Take a look at this. Now this is a proper sunstone. With energy like this, I should be able to make a really powerful weapon. Let's take it back to my house. So apparently you can make multiple... Uh, based on the... Uh... Oh, it just takes us back. First, we'll extract the sunstone's energy and convert it into a more manageable form. Then... We'll just vacuum pack it into a cartridge. Into a cartridge? You gonna pop this thing into a N64? Sunstone the game? And it's finished! Alright. Luca's got a cool gun, the wonder shot. Sometimes I amaze myself. Take a look at this, Luca. I borrowed a bit of the sunstone to create something nifty of my own. Sunglasses. I love that. Alright. So let's equip that. Oh, that's not. Equip is here. So you want the... Oh, it's, a, it's so much better. Random damage. Uh, is the sunglasses... 
some here. Sunglasses boosts damage. Uh, okay. Damage boost. Uh, I should also give the counter attack one back to frog. Which is it? Who's no, not that. No, no. No. Yeah, the rage band. Okay, and now we go to Melchior. We give him the thing. And we get a cool item. And we are good to go. It was this side, right? I already forget. Yes, it was. Okay, okay. All right. Melchior, I am back. I got a cool material for you to combine your thing with. All right. Ah, a sunstone. That should do quite nicely. What are we going to get? I didn't actually look on the, uh, the wiki page because I want to be surprised. My work is complete. Prism Spectacles. <laughs> Don't think that's my, uh, that's the last of my bag of tricks. These arms have, uh, some use left in them, yet. What's going on? My work is complete. Rainbow. I finally feel I'm doing something worthwhile. Okay, okay, okay. So... What do we what did we just get? Is the rainbow a weapon? The rainbow. Usable by Chrono. Crit rate 70%. 220 attack. Wasn't there another cool chrono weapon we got? The Demon Slayer. No no no. This? I don't know. Doesn't matter. The rainbow is sick. And the other one I'm guessing was. One of these is spectacle. Prism spectacles. Major damage boost. Uh, prismatic glasses that grant true power. So it seems like just a better version of the sunglasses. Yes, please. Major damage boost. I, I like that. All right. Well. This is definitely going to be two episodes because I've been recording for almost an hour. So, as I run out of this castle, if you guys did enjoy this episode, as always, make sure you leave a like, comment, and sub I'm not, I'm not, okay. Uh, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Tune in next time because I think it is finally time to stop procrastinating. We are about to get Chrono back. I'm hoping that I didn't mess up by doing all these side quests first and he's going to be super underleveled. But if he is, you know, it's fine. We got a cool sword for him. Uh, so we, you, to uh, quote the Avengers themselves, we're in the endgame now. We are in the endgame now. Uh, we've been in the endgame for quite some time. But now we are in, like, the end endgame. We're going to get Chrono back. And then we're going to the Ocean Palace. And we are going to finish this off once and for all. But I will see you guys then. But until then, don't forget to take it easy.